OpenBCI stands for Open Source Brain Computer Interface. Our goal is to provide anyone with a computer the tools necessary to sample the electrical activities of their body. With this in mind, we have several products on our store for you to experiment with your body's electrical biodata. This includes EEG, brain data, EMG, muscle data, and ECG, heart data. Additionally, all boards have an accelerometer for decoding movement and inputs for additional sensors. You will select a board based on how many electrodes you want to analyze data from. For most projects and neurofeedback experiments, the Ganglion board is a great place to start from, which allows for up to four input channels. If your research or project requires additional spatial resolution, you can purchase the Cyton board, which allows for up to eight input channels. Or the Cyton plus Daisy board, this combination allows you to measure from up to 16 different locations on the body or scalp. All of our boards send data over Bluetooth. The Cyton uses this dongle to connect to your computer. While the Ganglion uses your computer's existing Bluetooth hardware, most Windows and Linux computers are not compatible with the Ganglion's Bluetooth. So you might need to purchase the CSR dongle from our shop if you plan to use either of those operating systems. Advanced research might require you to use higher sample rates to do this, you should purchase the OpenBCI Wi-Fi Shield. The Wi-Fi Shield increases the sample rate by transmitting the data via Wi-Fi as opposed to Bluetooth and allows you to increase the sample rate up to 1000 Hz for the Cyton plus Daisy, up to 2000 Hz for the Cyton, and up to 1600 Hz for the Ganglion. Now that you have an OpenBCI board, you're going to need electrodes to play with. As you can see, the OpenBCI boards have male header connectors, so you will need electrodes that are compatible with those. If you are mainly doing research with EMG or ECG, then you can purchase our snap electrode cables with our foam solid gel electrodes. If you want to do EEG in conjunction with EMG and ECG, then you would purchase our gold cup electrodes. These electrodes are wet electrodes, which means they require EEG paste to work. You can affix these to yourself using some medical tape. If you already have some electrodes or an electrode cap you want to use with the OpenBCI boards, then you can purchase our touchproof cable adapter. This cable connects to the OpenBCI boards and then to a touchproof connector, which is the industry standard. This allows you to use your own electrode caps or other electrodes as well. If your electrode cap requires a different adapter, please contact us and we will help. If you are interested in doing EEG or head-based EMG, then you can purchase the Mark IV. The Mark IV is a frame with dry electrodes, which allows you to affix electrodes to the scalp without using any paste. If you want to avoid the use of electrode paste, this is a great way to go. The Ultra Cortex's electrodes are custom made and plated with silver silver chloride, which provide excellent dry EEG signal quality. You can either purchase the Mark IV with 8 electrodes to connect to the Ganglion or Cyton boards, or with 16 electrodes to connect to the Cyton plus DayZ setup. Because the Mark IV frame can be 3D printed, you can purchase the Mark IV Print It Yourself version, which includes all the electrodes, cables, and all other parts that aren't 3D printable. If you don't own a 3D printer, you can purchase the unassembled version, which includes all the 3D printed parts as well as the non-3D printed parts. Once you have all the necessary materials to build the headset, you can follow this tutorial to assemble the headset. If you don't want to bother with 3D printing or assembling the headset, then you can purchase a pro-assembled headset. This is assembled by our expert builders and comes with extra parts if you need to replace anything. Once you have your assembled headset, you can connect it to the open BCI boards and a battery and start getting EEG data. Now that you have all the necessary hardware, let's talk about software. The open BCI GUI is free to download and you can use it to get started with biosensing. We work hard to make sure that our platform is compatible with all other third-party biosensing software platforms, including OpenVibe, MATLAB, and more. For more information on this, check out the third-party software section of the learning pages. We hope this was helpful, and if you have any questions, email us or post on our forum. Mm -hmm.